Today, we're looking at something really cutting edge in AI video. It's about making multiple people talk and interact in a video, realistically, uh, just based on their audio. That's right. We're digging into a research paper that introduces this new framework. You can create such videos where multiple people are talking simultaneously. And by the end of the video, I'll give you how you can use this AI model. We'll give multiple video examples and generate so many videos. And by the end of the video, we'll also give you a tutorial on how you can exactly install it on your local machine, even on the low virtual RAM. So stay till the end of the video. I'm Aditya and you're watching Skill Curve. Let's first go to the hugging face repository of this model and it looks really interesting so they have a multiple feature like realistic conversation interactive character control and it can generate 720p output which is a very good thing when it comes to generating such quick model generation and you can hit all the thing in the hugging face repository if you go to file and versions here you can just download this model and you're ready to go but wait we'll see so many videos example first to get you an idea what we can generate from it so let's go to the first example we'll talk about so this first example let me give you a brief introduction about this model video so this is the two old timer people talking to each other with one woman and one guy with a hat and they're discussing multi-talk is a very interesting video model we can generate videos listen to this multi-talk is an audio driven video animation model wow i like multi-talk that's amazing Okay, you can see they both have a good expression on the face, which is really interesting when it comes to such quick and open source model. Let's talk about another video is where the guy and the girl talking to each other about multi-talk again and in the car, by the way. Do you know multi-talk? Wow, I know it. That's amazing. Okay, now you can see this uh, night show of the guy with the boat talking to each other with the host and the, another actor guy. They're both talking like a realistic human and it's also generated by multi uh, how'd you How'd you get into the, the, the looping machine? Uh, I went to go and see a band that I loved when I was about 14 and the guy was opening up. You can up. see another video like this. Uh, how'd, you, how'd you get into the, the, the looping machine? Uh... I went to go and see a band that I loved when I was about 14 and the guy was opening up. Okay, let's talk up. about some cartoon videos too because there are so many cartoon videos you can use. You can use it for examples on what multi-talk can actually generate. So... Did this kid with guitar, you know, playing with a dog puppy, and he's playing guitar. And the one thing you can notice is the video expression of those two are really accurate. Well, I don't understand what they're actually singing, but you can see now the exact lip sync and expressions are very accurate. Okay, another video we have is these two Asian people singing, where this guy and the girl singing, while the guy is actually looking at her. Living with a shadow overhead. Let's talk about some minions uh, video examples too. You're under arrest. Really? For what? Gee, I don't know. How about selling food without a permit? We also have a very cat and rabbit example. You can see in the background Disney uh, as a logo and look at the video first. Today, we're looking at something really cutting edge in AI video. It's about making multiple people talk and interact in a video, realistically, uh, just based on their audio. That's right. We're digging into a research paper that introduces this new framework. Uh, they call it multi -talk. Okay, so one thing you notice is that when the rabbit talks and it actually zooms out the picture and that's a really interesting way to see things like that. And I'm really impressed the way you know, this model is actually handling the two people conversation without mixing each other. So yeah, I'm very impressed by the way. Okay, let's talk about some other uh, singing videos too for this woman, uh, where this guy, you know, singing. Let's see that. Please come back now. Okay, so maybe I don't uh, use that so much singing because it can cause copyright issues. So you get an idea now what exactly kind of singing when it comes to this model. Let's talk about some other video examples too because we have so many video examples. Okay, let's talk about some other video examples where this war scene is this soldier fighting in exactly like World War game kind of scene. Let's see this video. Go, go, go. The war is coming to an end. We will be back home. Take care. Let's fight. Go, go, go. Okay, one thing I can say is sometimes multi-tech actually generate video which sounds very AI coded. So maybe this is one of those videos where the voices actually look like some AI generated. But overall, I would say it's still doing much better. 
okay now let's talk about some prompt too so here just like three prompts i have given okay let's see this so the first prompt is in a cozy warmly lit room nike wild and fox with mischievous grain sits across from beauty hop you can read the entire prompt on your screen it's pretty impressing and the both way they are moving you know the rabbit and the fox they are talking to each other interacting in you know touchy way and holding the cup and headphone that looks a really interesting chemistry the multi-talk has generated how is your workout today? I ran for 30 minutes and I'm exhausted. Works for everyone, but um, after unifying it, I think it looks... We have another video is where a man and a woman are seated at an outdoor table engaged in a conversation. The woman dressed in a light pink top with a white card. And you can read the entire prompt. I'm not going to go to read it all, but you can see they both are really realistic people, actually. And the way they are talking to each other is also one of the good things. Today, we're looking at something really cutting edge in AI video. It's about making multiple people talk and interact in a video, realistically, uh, just based on their audio. That's okay, the, uh, this video is also very interesting where the two individuals sit at a white table and studio. So it's kind of video video setup where these two people talking, where this guy, you know, having cup, tea, talking, and another girl is wearing headphones. So both have a very good expression. The multi-talk is doing a very impressive job here, actually. So now we are on the hugging face space. So here we can generate this um, videos with the help of this uh, multi talk. So let's talk about it. The first video we generated. So you can read the prompt in a cozy recording room and a man and a woman singing together. The man with the uh, you know brown hair standing on the left wearing a light green button shirt. And you can do the entire prompt. The entire prompt is pretty detailed actually. And if you don't want to write detailed prompt, just go to ChatGPT. It will write for you no worries so just this entire prompt and we just uploaded the image which is conditioning image and what we did is you can see we gave two voices and added it in the wave format remember the voice in the wave format so it's just much more good in quality if you click on advanced setting you can see the sample steps 12 you can increase the sample step but i would say just stick with it and you can see now the video However, the quality of video may be not that high, but overall, I'm really impressed by this by this multi-talk model. Okay, now we have seen the video, how we generate the video. Now let's talk about what if we want to actually create it on your local machine and install it. So let's talk about it. So we'll go to the GitHub page of this multi-talk AI gen and all the link is in the description. So you don't have to find one by one and you can scroll down and you can see there's so many code has written. And once you go a little bit down, you can see there's community work like Van2GP. Van2GP is one of the safest bet if you are on the low VRAM and want to run this. You can install it, but how are we gonna install it? I'll tell you, do not worry. There are also some of the demos like Comfy UI and Google Collab. Comfy UI and Google Collab can be a little bit complex actually. So let's go to the Van 2 GP and it's very straightforward by the way. You don't have to install everything one by one. Okay, let's go to the Van 2 GP's uh, simple GitHub repository and go to the installation part. The link is in the description. So you just simply go directly here. So you can see that there's installation guide.md and there's a big installation guide. So don't get confused. I'll tell you what to do first. Okay, simply just open the command prompt if possible, open it as a run as administrator. Okay, once you open it, here you can see now just git clone van to GP. Now, once you copy this command and paste it, if it does not work, you have to go to the Git website here. You can see on the screen and download Git software. And once you downloaded it, you can also download Python 3.10. And if you don't have Conda, simply go to the Conda's website and download this mini Conda you can see on the screen. And that's it. And make sure you have some compatible GPU. Okay, you can read it on the guidelines. It's not that big issue. Now, once you Git clone the repository, you can see the folder is looking interesting. Now, what you need to do is in the command prompt, look CD van to GP. What this prompt will do is will give you the folder access. And now you have to run the command like conda create hyphen and van to GP with this Python environment and it will activate van to GP. It will take a little bit time. So just wait and watch. And once you install it, it's time for something interesting. Now time to install the PyTorch in the step two, you can just copy it from the guideline installation readme file. Once you copy it, just simply paste it. Once you activate the entire Conda environment, you can see how you're gonna 
do it. Just simply paste it. And once you paste it, it will take a lot of time. Actually, you download some large files like 3 GB files, 4 GB files. And once it done, simply click on this third step, which is install the requirement.txt. Now it will download all the dependencies and requirements. So if you haven't code ever, you may not get this point. So just copy it and paste it. And that's it. There are also some optional steps like which will increase the speed of your generation like if you have a 50xx type of compatible RTX and you can upload the step 4 or you can use CH2 for attention for 40% faster speed. Well, you can do it simply just paste the pip install right on Windows but I would say just simply ignore it if you don't want a lot of mesh. So yeah, the, the Vant GP has been already installed. Now simply just run this python.bind to gp this command and that's it. Now you can see on your local host, you can see this software has been opened. Now it's a big software honestly and honestly you have to work around it like how you're gonna use it. So let me tell you how you use it. Okay, once you open the WAN to GP, this is the entire interface. It opens in browser. Do not confuse it that it's online. No, it's totally offline. You can see the local host 7860. And now you can see there are so many options and maybe you get confused. So let me tell you how to do that. So first you can see the big uh, on the screen, this option of so many models once you click in the drop down menu like Phantom, Sky Reels, Text Video. And here you can see he multi talk 780p 20p so once you click multi talk 480p and 720p you can choose any of them i would go with 480p for easy resolution or you can choose anyone i'm just here to explain you the little bit tool and once you click on the left side there are base model like van 2.1 2.2 ltx hanyan you can choose any of these model which all are open source so you can use any of them and here you can see there are so many things here you can drop down your media you can drop down your image and here you can you can see how it now this is a max resolution of your video so i would say go with 16 ratio 9 if you want a ratio like youtube videos and here now you can upload so many images videos and so yeah that's it now you click on the guide option and here it will guide you some um, things about this entire software which you don't need to know honestly here you can read the video marks creator it's also not very thing and here you can read on configuration here you can actually do some settings like dimensions attention type metadata handling and if you want to create the last videos keep the last videos keep the 10 videos it's totally up to you and if you want to you know use uh, display the read vram and in other stats you can disable it and you can enable it if you want to increase the number of frames you can click on x2 x3 totally up to you and if you want to increase you know the interface frame like blue sky classic video you can change it too so yeah, this is exactly the main interface of this van to gp now it's totally up to you how you want to use it so this is the entire that's it once you generate a video it will download some of the models from the online to your computer and that's it so yeah this is how exactly you can use this model this multi-talk model on your local machine and we have already seen the videos and how to generate them so you can read that too if you like this video just simply click on like button share it and for more such cutting edge tutorial latest technologies videos every day just subscribe to the channel.